video I will show you how to overclock your RAM. First you gotta start your computer. Then when the computer is loading the BIOS, get ready to press delete. And I'm just hitting delete now. Don't know if you can see that. And then your computer will automatically enter the BIOS. Now notice that every BIOS is different from the manufacturer. I have an ASRock motherboard, therefore I have the ASRock OE VI set up with TDT. But um, the procedure is the same for every type of brand. First you got to take uh, overclocking trigger, OC trigger. Some motherboards may have a different name and if, if it's uh, not a graphical BIOS you can just uh, read it somewhere. Just gonna take the OC trigger. And then you got to find the DRAM configuration and you can see the DRAM frequency. I already overclocked mine, but notice this. Every time you buy any kind of RAM, it will stand out go on 1333. So if you buy anything from uh, anyone saying that it is over, like I did, I bought an Corsair Vengeance 1866, but when you install it in your system, it will not run at 1866, it will run at this. And if you don't do this, it won't run at 1866 at all. So, into the OC trigger, find the DRAM configuration, DRAM frequency, and change it from 1333 to whatever type of memory you bought. And I bought the 1866. Then you hit the exit button, or just escape if you don't have a graphical BIOS, and then save changes, changes and exit, and confirm. This is probably the most easiest overclocking you can find. So, the plus with this is that you don't need any additional cooling. As you can see here, I'm just running standard Corsair. Vengeance 8 GB 1866 MHz. No additional cooling. And then it's just, it just boots up and you have your overclocked RAM at the frequency you bought it at.